With his personal life constantly under scrutiny, Ranbir Kapoor says it's no big deal. Known as the actor superstar, Ranbir tells us about the thing that he's unapologetically shameless about and how people will be pleasantly surprised with his over-the-top avatar in Besharam. When I spoke to you last time, you said you didn't like the term superstar either, but you were a super actor. But now they call you the acting superstar, the actor superstar. So still uncomfortable with the term? No, no, I love it. Uh, uh, I love it a lot. And uh, yeah, I love it. <laughs> the response to the movie, the promos initially have been a little underwhelming as in comparison to your other films. So do you think it's a good thing that people really don't know what they are in for? You know what? We are making cinema which is out there for people to compliment, to criticize, to like, to dislike. And you can't really, uh, 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 you can't really feel bad if people are not liking your promos and you when you when you feel so good when people are liking your promos you know uh, we worked hard i still believe in the content of the film i still believe in the merit of the film and i guess in a way it reduces expectations so people will only get pleasantly surprised uh, you know that's a good way of looking at it what are the one things that you are unapologetically shameless about uh, my talent if i can say it uh, i'm very arrogant where that's concerned and uh, and that's what you know gives me the confidence that's what keeps me going so i guess my talent is the only thing that i'm very proud and and also like expressed you've always been very honest about everything in life but do you think that this current spotlight on your personal life people in your privacy being invaded do you think that somewhere the line has been crossed no you know i mean you feel bad because your personal space has been encroached but now as it, as actors you have to just believe that you're public property you know and uh, when i was young if i had a favorite star i wanted to know what he's doing uh, you know where he eats food, who he eats with. So if people are interested, it's fine. You know, I think the media has given me a lot. You know, they've they've put me on a platform. You know, and made me the star that I am today. And uh, you know, they have all the right to. You know, ha the tabloid culture in our country is is increasingly growing. Today, everyone's a paparazzi because you have camera phones. You know, everyone's a journalist because you have social networking platforms to express yourself. And as an actor, you have to understand that your public property and you'll be spoken about. So you can't really feel bad and say, how can this person do that? How can this person do that? If you feel bad, deal with it. You know, it's, it's part and parcel of the job. So the national obsession with your marriage, what do you make of it? Maybe should we have a swimmer for you? Uh, no, no. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm very capable of finding a wife for myself. And um, I believe in the institution of marriage. And uh, right now I'm not ready. Uh, that's why I don't speak about my personal life also. And the day I'm ready, I'll openly speak. I don't want to hide my wife. You know, I want to be open. I want to travel with her and, and not really face questions about paparazzi pictures.